All right, Honda. What are you doing at the Shomokai headquarters? Using God Zeus and Noo, huh? Oh, never mind. With his power. Ah, found him. Honda's over there. Hmm? Oh, it's you. Did you come looking for me? Uh... You're going nowhere. <laughs> I'm not doing that. I'll never give up. What can you do all by yourself? Please, stop this! Atsuro? You say that. Would you like to take a look at the main character? Although this okay, not say all by himself, but I mean Hold it! You're not touching him! He's not by himself! MC doesn't know. <laughs> You're Honda, right? We're right there with you, dude. Huh? Who are you? <laughs> You're out to take that comp outside the lockdown, aren't you? The more help you have, the better. So why not team up with us and deal with them? I see. You have your own intentions for the comps, I assume. Hell yeah! I ain't letting go of power like this so easily. Our demons are chump change compared to that insane one you have. But we can fight. How about it? We both got nothing to lose. Let's join forces and break through the lockdown. We'll do whatever we can to help. All right. Then let's work together. Well... More enemies? Looks like their goal is to get their comps out of here. Well. <laughs> Looks like the tables have turned. We'll beat you and make our escape. Have you heard about our Lord and Savior, Garuda? Yeah! Messiah God, I don't give a crap. I just hope you're ready. T time for the coffin dance. <laughs> I would play that, uh, I would look up that song to play, but I don't want to get my stream DMCA'd. Mm. Oh, you who challenge the winged uh, one or the winged ones of different skies, I shall grant you my power. Whoa! Whoa! Huh? Whoa! What's this? I'm overflowing with power. Uh oh. <sighs> that voice! No way! Is that another guardian deity? Sheesh, can't we ever catch a break? Here goes, Mr. Messiah! Oh no, <laughs> he's gonna go Super Saiyan on us! <laughs> Look at him shaking! Oh hell! This, this is how you know it's serious! They got the bell theme as their boss theme! Shield? Wait, you get a shield all first thing? What the fuck? That's broken! Wait... Yo, wait, Susano looks cool! Beast Eye, two actions in one turn, life lift, 20% HP. Biz Amp, Ancient Mars, enable second skirmish, can move through objects. Okay, so you got Flight, or you got Phantasma, and you got Double Up, so... I, Ancient Mars actually isn't that special though. Uh, Honda... Wait, you got your own Amaterasu? Uh, you got your own Murmur too. Oh, god damn it. Oh... Oh, boy. Well, we got our work cut off for us. Mirror match. <laughs> okay. Hmm. I feel like I should use some of the others, but I don't know. Like, it's already getting to the whole uh, point with uh, too many party members. <laughs> uh, because like, I I like to stick with the original three uh, plus Amani since this is her route. Uh, you know what? We'll just we'll just take out Yuzu and substitute. Mari. Midori. Uh, I mean, I, 
I'd like to use Midori, but I don't want my ears. I, I don't wanna. Or I don't know. Like, she'll only have like what, like one or two voice lines in in the battle, but. I, 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 it really bothers me that I, I actually just don't want to use her anymore. <laughs> I, don't, uh, I don't mean to bully her, but yeah. You remember reading a fanfic series about Midori going through later Persona games after this? Huh. I got a lot that sounds interesting. Okay, uh, main character, you can be the broken one with, uh, make it along too. Uh, Mara, you can have Holy Dance. Amane, you can have, uh, actually, you know what? No, no, you take that. You take regular Megido. So basically, everyone has their own special <clears throat> uh, almighty damage source. Uh, let's see. We have anti all. I would say the main weakness with this is if we get hit with magic, we're pretty screwed. So I'd say that we put on... Uh, Probably Barrier. Let's see, Grace, Marksman, Rage, Soul, Battle, or Dual Shadow, Strength, and Change Weaknesses to Normal Resistances. Uh, I'd say we take Barrier. We... Uh... Actually, we can, we can flip these guys. Uh, let's see, debilitate. Well, Miggy Delon is gonna take up a lot of mana, so I actually need to cut down on the mana cost. So that leaves Miss Mari with Blitzkrieg. Unless there was something else, but I don't know. Uh, what's an issue with this team? Uh, no heals. No heals. Okay, uh, we'll take Grace then. And she's taking Grace, uh, you'll need uh, a way to get your mana back. So mana 8 is already on uh, Amane, so you'll get Drain, and let's see, there's no good source of healing, so Meteoran, or yeah. Also, who has a... Uh... No, that's the rest of the party. I guess the MC can take uh, the revive here in case someone else dies. See, no heals. Prayer. And I guess, uh, Recarm. Bizamp. Hmm. Uh, what can we put here then? Uh, let's see, extra one. Dream Feast, that's the only reasonable thing I can think of. Cause like, basically we just use this and we don't think about anything else. Uh, okay, let's see, What's, what do we got going on for resistances? Uh, force, physical... Force, physical... Uh, electric... 
fire, force, physical, electric, fire. Okay, so basically the four resist resistances. Does anyone have Bufu? They do. So basically, we need a bit of everything, but it seems like they're more leaning towards physical and force. Uh, actually, I don't know. This looks like an even distribution. Uh, if anything, uh, let's get ice drain. Yeah, drain. Uh, this amp pierce. Actually, let's remove this and put in like. Uh, Force ref Wait, do they even have Force Drain? Let's Force Reflect. Now there's- no, that's a Force Drain. No, we can't do- we can't do Force uh, Reflect. If anything, we... Null Force. Uh, oh yeah, Race O, because we're fighting against humans now. Um... Ooh. Uh, well, let's give that- that one to Amane. And let's put race defense on Mari because I have a bad feeling about how much damage she'll be taking. Should we make her survivable? Let's make her survivable. Because basically, like here's like uh, this is the strat. Like we go in. Let's say we t happen to take a lot of damage if we can't wipe right away. Uh, the the main leader guys can't really kill us. We go down to one health. The battle ends. We go into another battle. Cast prayer and everyone's back at 100% health. Easy. All right. I think that's uh, that's about it. We good. We good. The main character, which one do you want to take on? Strengthen, health safe, evil wave. Let's go. Hey! Artoria Lancer, nice. Wait, they get to move? Whoa! Wait! Oh, I just noticed! They've been powered up so much they can actually move before I can. They have 65 speed each. Well, except for Honda and Susano. Oh, okay, That that's how they're gonna... That's how they're gonna play, uh, day eight. Like, they actually have turn priority over me. <laughs> the Messiah, huh? What a bunch of saps. Everyone, keep this quote in mind until, uh, after we kick his ass. <laughs> you think I give a shit about your weakness? Boy, let me tell you. You gonna make some food? Alright, Jace. Enjoy food. <laughs> okay. Are you gonna run away now? Let's see. Ah, they're, they're too strong! <laughs> I was like, what a bunch of stuff. They're too strong! Run away! Nah, nah, Jace. <laughs> oh, right, you don't have a... Uh... Ooh. God? Angels? Why on earth should I obey them? Just with more anime. Uh, make it alone. I'll see. 
Ah, uh, deathbound. Oh, boom. Damn! Just good job, my dude. He saw how screwed he was and he committed suicide. Are we gonna lose? God, it's just so... Uh, I hope that was spawn face every time I hear Johnny on watch. His voice is everywhere. You think you're safe with your wall? Have you heard about our- have you heard about a uh, multi-strike and fizz repel? You think I care about your extra turns? You can take those extra turns to the grave! No. I had a feeling we wouldn't beat these guys. Oh my god, this is so derp easy. I'm sorry, everyone. Raging god Susanoo, lend me your strength. I will. The foreign god and king of Bell have no dominion over this country. Oh. Huh. Damn it. All I wanted was to get rich quick. <laughs> Generic lines. Hey, about that shield all. Okay, well, I mean, you got me there with... Oh. Oh, you barely sur You barely left. Oh. Oh. Never mind. <laughs> Me. Darn. Okay, I don't know who I want to take on first. Uh, I want to. I want to try this guy. How tough can you be? Well, for one thing, let me see how much mana you got. Eh. That was kind of not worth. Ow. Right, life lift. You know, in hindsight, I should have spec'd for uh, Ice Dance. Oops.
Oh. Remember, he doesn't have that much mana. Want to do that? Ah, oh, so close. Oh, oh, oh. I, 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 thought we, I thought we barely avoided uh, beating him. Or, uh, whatever. I took Honda to come. What a shabby soul is this to yield so easily. Well, no matter. Rest there. Oh, wait. Oh no, you reflect. I, I actually can't do anything here. Well, maybe Garuda can. Yeah, I actually need to move away from him. Double speed for the uh, turn priority. Such dreadful power doth he possess. This can't be. Is the Overlord too much even for Susanoo's power? Oh, we're finally done. Whew, that was tough. So if Honda's not going to be the final boss of this chapter, um... Who the hell is? Thank you for your efforts, everyone. Why? I just wanted to go back to my son. You could just get in line, my dude. You don't need a comp. <laughs> I was given a mission to bring back a comp. Oh. My son's medical bills were sky high. If I didn't do this, I could never pay them. And it's impossible now. Even with Susanoo's power, I couldn't beat you. There's nothing left for me. Nothing whatsoever! Oh. Hey! What? Honda! Why didn't anyone grab him? He's gone. I feel kind of sorry for him. I sympathize with his poor fortune, but we can make no exceptions for any tamer. This is how it should have been. Using demons to attain one's happiness is wrong. Trampling upon the feelings a man concerned for his child. Is this your new world? 
It's that voice we heard a minute ago. This is an O again. Oh, oh no. Hmm. My name is, uh, wait, Okuni, uh, Okuni nu uh, Nushi. I am the creator god of this island nation. <sighs> Okuni Nushi? Hmm. I have seen your power. You drove off Susano, proving that I underestimated you. It was you, wasn't it? You gave those tamers power and Susanoo to Honda. Why would you do all that? What are you trying to do? Hmm. I am this land's creator. I cannot hand it over to your like. Hmm. No king of Bell could bring this nation together. Maybe you're right. No, I can and I will. Indeed. He is the only one recognized by God as the Messiah. I'm positive that he'll prove to be an excellent leader. You, however, have abdicated this nation once. Why do you show yourself now? Yeah. You had a whole week to help out uh, everyone within the Yamanote circle. Hmm. See. I abdicated because I determined that humans could take responsibility. It's not like you're the one who put up the ordeal. Hmm. I've continued to watch over this country in the ages since. Hmm. And now you have come here, attending to wrest control of what I created. Hmm. I did not recall performing the ritual abdication with you. That is why I have come. Well, you can hand it over to us, now. Mm -hmm. So you believe that you can prove your worthiness to reign over this nation? Mm -hmm. Very well, I shall test you to see if you are truly worthy of the- are truly worth of- Worth? Worthy of leadership. What do we need to do? Mm -hmm. As the name implies, a messiah is one with the power to save the world and his people. Mm -hmm. As luck would have it, one related to you suffers uh, eternal punishment from your god. Ah, uh, I knew we'd be getting back to now, yeah. So if we can, if we can change now, or er, change Naya's ways. Holy shit, that, ooh, that's gonna be one of the most daunting tasks. Mm. Bring salvation to this human and I will acknowledge your power and leave you in peace. Bring it on. Mm. <laughs> yes, prove to me that you can live up to the mantle you have claimed. But wait, the conditions are too vague. How will we know if they've been saved? You put such a question to me, and you call yourself the Messiah? Ridiculous. Oh. Mm. Think deeply about why this person's sin is not forgiven. Mm. But there isn't much time. Many of this land are opposed to your methods. Mm -hmm. You have until 1800. Mm. If you can overcome the trial by then, my minions and I will take back the land. Mm. At which time, I will return the land to the original void and create a new nation. Oh. Return it to the void? Mugu. <laughs> oh! Oh no! His original void? Does that mean he's gonna destroy Japan? We got our death clocks back! Oh no! What's gonna happen to all the people here? I don't care if he is the god who created Japan! We can't let him do that! Damn it! This is bad. We only have until evening. That's not a lot of time. So Okuninushi was the one giving power to the demon tamers. Hey, Amane. What kind of god is Okuninushi? Simply put, he is the god who created the nation of Japan. But it seems that Okuninushi had no intention of ruling over his own country. He forfeited his right to rule to another, in a process called abdication. Oh, so that's why you brought up that abdication thing to convince him. And he's willing to do it if we save someone from eternal punishment, right? Yes, and I believe he already knows who this someone is. I do? I think I do. My cousin now. <laughs> the Shomokai found the dude's dead. 
In all likelihood, yes. He was referring to your cousin. Oh, yeah. I remember that coming up when we fought him yesterday. Just as he was Abel, Naoya was Cain. Since Cain killed his brother Abel, he received a punishment that persists to this day. Is this about what you said yesterday? He'll be punished until he faces his sin. Still, his life must have been more hellish than we can imagine. He's had ages to think things through, and he still decided to get revenge against God. Still, it was Naoya telling me to hold on to the comps that got us into all this. I blame the Shomo cat. No, that ended up saving us. Oh, well, that's true. But still... I agree. He became the Messiah as a result of you three acquiring comps. It depends on how we look at it. He did drag everyone into the lockdown. But in giving us comps, he also gave us the means and the power to survive. You're right. And he did let him make his own decision in the end. Hmm. We gotta thank him. <laughs> yeah, in the end, I feel the same way. Oh, Kuninushi aside, I want to help Naoya. But how can we save him? I mean, this punishment came directly from God. Yet we must not give up. Our only choice is to begin by speaking to him. But our deadline is sundown. What's going to happen if we can't do it? Our death clock says zero. What? Oh, come on. Give us a break. Okuninushi said that if we fail, he'll destroy Japan and make it over again. A clean slate. And we'd be wiped off along with everything else. Let's hurry. Yeah, there's not much time left, so let's get moving and find Naoya. Suzano can now be fused. Well, I found Naoya. They're not... Oh, oh. Man, they really aren't giving us much time to look over all this. Ah. Well, you have Awakening, but you're leaning towards... Hmm. Oh, you already come with... Oh... Actually, how much money do we have? Not enough to buy another Garuda. Excuse me. Sorry. Oh, oh. Okay. So we can just simply put uh anti most and be done with it. So anti most pierce and probably deathbound because like we don't have the agility to make use of uh, multi-strike. Okay. How about we go do a quick thing of grinding real quick? And then we'll get right back to it.
Loki is getting so much XP. See. Oh, you want to go for Atsuro, do you? Uh, I hate to break it to you, dude. Or he can try killing himself. I. Oh. Um. Oh my god, wait, wait. Look at our technical bonus. That's crazy. That's the highest I've ever seen a technical bonus go, just because of multi-strike. Thanks for the free money, my dude! job. Uh, tickled. Thank you for the drain? Hey, Natty. How you doing? Hey, there we go. Another level down, uh, on our belt. Just get, just max out magic at this point. That's our main goal. Because we can survive long enough, we just need to explode things. I'm really liking the flow we're getting into in this uh, end game, pretty much. Uh, there's like a little bit of lag there because of the sacrifice proc. If uh, if a fallen species demon kills something, it restores HP and mana, but since we killed two things at the same time, I guess the game is slowly trying to resolve that for some reason? It shouldn't be that slow, but that's how it is. Um, uh, money? Yeah. Let's go register again. You. Uh, you. You... Uh, let's go buy another Garuda. Uh, let's search for Susano. Hmm, I wonder which... I wonder which Garuda I'll be, I'll be using. Hmm, this one with less XP or the one with more? Okay. Sadly, we lose our double up, but it's a sacrifice we'll have to make. Uh, do I want the stat distribution to be like that, or can I fix that? Well, we can get 40 strength, that's a possibility. We can balance it out. But I think I prefer uh, max strength pretty much. Or if we can actually split this more towards vitality. Ooh, uh, actually I don't like that. Actually, you know what? Let's just let's just do it like this. So let's see. So we know for sure that he can't take multi strike. Uh, let's take death bound. Pierce, Antimos, 
Fizz Amp, uh, to go along with the Death Bound. Uh, I would also think of Fire Repel, but that can actually work against us, because we're kind of coming into more, or going into more enemies that have, like, let, like, spell for one type of element, while being able to drain the same element. So, we can't exactly counter them with this, so that actually sustains them. So, I think we'll leave it like this. There we go. So, reflects everywhere. God, this man, this is what a real endgame Devil Survivor looks like. Physical reflects everywhere. I don't know how I feel about that, but oh well. can because like thing is we don't have much time our t uh our time is up once it hits 1800 but I, uh how about i do it like this let's just go read what everyone has to say and we'll go with the most interesting choice or interesting uh cutscene and i'm sure we still need to talk with now yeah actually wait i'm curious about this what if we just skip ahead yuzu or not yeah like now it is the mandatory one. Oh god, it's so slow. I need to restart Citra. Yeah, I was noticing that we were getting a bit of lag when uh, we were entering the fight with Suzunoo. There we go. Oops, lost cursor. There we go. Okay, let's start with Amane. Hey Amane, do you know about Japanese mythology too? Hmm? I have some knowledge of it, yes. Oh good! Then can you tell us what kind of god Okuninushi is? Then I'll explain. Okuninushi is the creator god of Japan, as written in the Kojiki. What else? Hmm. He took Susarihime, Susanoo's daughter, as his wife. Uh, what else? But Okuninushi died twice before meeting Susarihime. Twice? Huh? Twice? How'd he get killed so often? He was murdered by his brothers. First, he was burned to death, then crushed. Each time, his mother, Sasukuni Wakahime, resurrected him. And on the third attempt, Okuninushi, just as he was about to be pierced to death by arrows, finally fled. That was when he reached the country ruled by Susanoo. Begins to tell the story of Japan without skipping a beat. Aragami. <laughs> wow! Talk about a stormy life! I so wouldn't want to go through any of that. After those traumatic events, Susanoo told him to create a nation. Japan is the result. Pan is his people. Yeah, even if he did make it, we're the ones actually living here. The land's creator and its inhabitants. Neither can give any ground. Still, in order for him to lead the people of this country, we must overcome Okuninushi's ordeal. Yeah. Well, thanks, Amane. Let's move on. Okay, so we get some, some lore with... Uh... Okuninushi. Also, that rig ten pool. Wow. Uh, we'll look at the other ones later. Uh, let's see. Let's look at Izuna. Halt! No trespassing. Ah! Stop! Don't shoot! Oh, it's you. Why are you here? Uh, 
It's about Kane, Okunushi. Kane? Sorry, I have no idea. If it was about something else, I might have been able to help you. Oh, hey, do you know anything about Okuninushi? Okuninushi? Okuninushi's forced a pretty tough problem on us. I see. Must be tough being the messiah. So, Izuna, do you know anything about Okuninushi? Well, he's enshrined in Izumo Grand Shrine. He's Sukuna Hikuna's brother. He created Japan. You know, Amani tells us a lot better here. That's about it. Except how the demon tamers acting up have been dropping his name. Dropping his name? They're mentioning him? They're claiming Okuninushi granted them power and they tried to break through here. Their goal seems to have been taking comps out into the world. Really? Were you okay? I'm standing here, aren't I? I guess they were careless not thinking I'd have a comp. But they seem to have known this place leads outside. If they came in force. Yikes! We'll handle things before that happens. Not much time until sundown, anyway. Sundown? You sound like you're really under the gun. Uh, Izuna, you still have your comp, right? You're the leader of the group, right? Or is that, uh, Fushima? The time limit of Okuninushi's ordeal is sundown today. Once it's up, Okuninushi is going to destroy this land and rebuild anew. What? He's going to wipe out the whole country? Yep. Oh my god. And you just took care of the demons. We're still lifting the lockdown. It seems we've once again burdened you with the fate of Japan. I joined this team to protect my country. But I can't do half as much for it as you. Everyone does their part. Oh shit. Oh shit. That is a bug. Oh fuck. Uh. Uh. Oh shit. Oh shit. Hold on. Fuck. Okay, I got it. I don't know what kind of bug it was. It looked it looked long. It was crawling on the wall. I heard man. What the fuck? There's a second one. I can't find it. Uh, I don't think it's poisonous, but I don't like this thing crawling around my room. Um, where the hell is it? Did it wait, did it fall on my PS4 case? No? Hold on, I need to find this bug. Uh, I don't- where is it? Oh god damn, it's gonna be crawling around my room while I'm sleeping. Well, man, I, I don't get it. There's been more and more popping up, and I've been. Where are they? And these aren't just like the. And these aren't just like uh, ants I was dealing with like uh, a couple days ago. There's just some other bugs. Like, what the heck? This house is heckin' cursed, dude. I swear. Yeah, it- uh, With my failed attempt to try to 
catch it. It probably fell on the floor and it's crawling around somewhere. Probably behind like, uh, probably behind like this drawer here, but it's heavy as hell and I need, I'm gonna need some help like lifting it out of the way. That or I'd have to do the tedious thing of, oh, right. Uh, in front of my huge drawer is my table where I have like my tower and monitors all set up. Oh, fuck me, dude. So let me check something. Is there anything in my closet? Any bugs in here? No? At the very least, I'll guard this place with my life so you can concentrate on the ordeal. So... Hang in there and don't give up. I can't do much, but I'll always be on your side. Hmm, okay, so that was Izuna's. Hmm, although that makes me wonder, like, why is Yuzu still here? Ah, uh, Messiah! Thank you for what you did back there! Seeing you rehabilitate that Yakuza made my heart feel clean as well. It's thanks to them too. It's true that that man who heeded your words was admirable in his own right. But I believe that it was possible because of your strength as the Messiah. You also did well surrendering your comp. If you hadn't, you would have been judged. <laughs> I'm glad it didn't come to that. After letting go of the comp and seeing you persuade that Yakuza, I did some thinking. Till then, I had no confidence in myself. I thought if I had a comp, that could change. It wasn't your strength. You're absolutely right. The strength I found wasn't mine, just the comps. After gaining the comp and then letting it go, I came to realize something. If I don't change how I feel, nothing about me will change. I look around and see people actively trying to adjust to this new world. I need to change too. That's what I decided. Yakuza in this game. Yeah, we've been beating him up this whole game. I'm truly blessed to have been able to meet the Messiah. Please continue to show us the way. Thank you so much. I'm glad for people like that, who can come to their own realization without our help. He's the kind of person that we need to keep doing our best to help. Okay, that's like uplifting, but what about the other one? If I had to choose, like, which cutscene to stick with, I'd probably just stick with, uh, Amane's. Is that... look over there. Huh? An angel? It looks like it has something to say! Oh no. It's gonna say... Uh, I know what it's gonna say, alright. Oh. Mm. Messiah, it seems you have been given a new ordeal by the guardian deity of this land. Oh. Okay, you know, you know what? <sighs> he lent his strength to demon tamers and now they stand in opposition to you. But the Lord believes that you will overcome this ordeal and spread his order. He sounds, yes, these, th this is what we've been dealing with this whole chapter. Ah! <laughs> I'll meet those expectations. Oh. Your resolve is commendable. We too believe in you, but you must know this. Oh. This ordeal was a transaction between you and the guardian deity. We cannot intervene. Oh. Similarly, we cannot judge the demon tamers who have been granted the deity's power. So sinch. Uh, they could have picked any other voice line to make, dude. Oh. We suggest that you leave this mi the, or leave the mission to spread God's order and manage sinners to us. Oh. You will then be able to focus fully on overcoming the gar Guardian Deity's ordeal. Insert your favorite gachi emo. So you're not gonna help us! Oh. The future of this nation is in your hands. We expect great things from you. Oh well, we have to do something by sundown. Or he says he'll remake Japan. It's up to us, then. Let's do our best. 
Yeah, these... Mm, some of these cutscenes, like... Really don't do much. 